Warning, this video may contain language or subjects you may find upsetting. If you are one of these people, I advise you not to watch. If you choose to watch this video, you have been warned. Hello everyone and welcome again to Studio with Easy Gaming Channel, trying to put some fun back into gaming. And as you can see, I've got the beta review for you. I'm going to tell a little story first. Sorry if it bores you, but I want to get how I've come to this conclusion. I was going to do one straight away afterwards but there's no point i haven't played it so uh yeah so the friday night jumped on didn't like it truly truly didn't like it if i was making a video then i wouldn't have played it so I jumped on again the saturday morning but overnight it occurred to me the time i felt like that every time i don't like it was this is that this is what i tried to play a new game so it's a bit more tactical so i tried that again in the morning i had some good games my nephew come over uh this game sort of aimed towards him is trying to get him away from Fortnite and he's trying to get him away from Rainbow Seven and he said he's not interested <laughs> the Battle Royale he's not interested but he had a jump on and I agreed I, he said it's not bad yeah so so jumped on again last night I think it's more the connection to be honest because it was terrible <laughs> terrible so I left it and I've been unsure what to say to be honest so I Jumped on again today, and yeah, yeah, a couple of little updates have been, and it's been all fucking right. <laughs> it has. I've, I've enjoyed it. I've enjoyed it more than I've hated it. So, bad points. The sound is terrible. It is really, really terrible. And like I said, I've got this. A, I've got the A forty, so it's like a surround sound. Terrible. Uh, graphics. My nephew said they were good, but. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. They're not true 4K, I don't suppose. And it did look a bit... Uh, weapons? Uh, I haven't got to unlock them all yet. Uh, but, yeah, time to kill is a bit of an issue. Especially with lag. Like I said, I've experienced it in other games like uh, Destiny and stuff like that. But we'll see. We'll see. Specialist ourselves? <laughs> nothing. Nothing. It's the same as the old ones, but... They've been nerfed a bit. What I mean by that is, yeah, one of them's got a grenade, all the rest have got like other bits and bobs. So it is very, very Rainbow Six or Rainbow whatever. And my nephew, he's into that type of stuff. But as a Call of Duty game, people don't want that. And I get that, I get I get that, but So is it a good game or a bad game? I don't know. <laughs> I want to say I don't like it, but I've jumped on and I've had about four or five hours of playing it. Once you, if you get in a decent team, if you get a decent connection, it's not a bad. It's a bit like WW2. Depends on who's playing because, like I said, I've been playing that. Yesterday was on with the French, and yesterday, uh, yeah, last night I don't know. WW2 is the same. Every time I have a bad connection, there's people from fucking Turkey, man. So I don't know where the European servers at the moment. So yeah, I don't think there's one in the UK anymore. So, is it worth getting? If you like your tactical games where you've got to put your team in together, yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely. But if you like your running around, just shooting shit, don't care about your objective, you, you get it because you'll get your kills, but you'll soon get bored of it because more and more people who, who like doing that stuff will get better at that and defending and that sort of stuff. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, so it's up to you, people. I haven't streamed. Because like I said, I don't know how I feel about it, truly. I was disappointed. I played it again, like I said, tonight. I, 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 yeah, I've, I've enjoyed playing it. It's mental. So, uh, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, what would I like to see happen to it? Like I said, I am bothered about the Battle Royale. If Raven make it, it might be all right. But they have no intention of leaving Fortnite for that. They can't play it. They play it because they're 12 or above, you know what I mean? Whereas you have to be 18. Most parents won't let them play 18. They sort of can't say you can't play a 12 game. So, uh, yeah. So, I, like I said, I've, I've struggled all weekend with what to say. At some point, yeah, it's not Call of Duty. But they did say it's different. It's a whole new way of playing it. So, uh, we'll see. Well, the second beta next weekend, so you've got an Xbox or the PC get it uh just to try it just to try it top tip 
go on Amazon if you're a Prime member, pre-order it, and you don't have to pay anything, and they'll send you the code. That's how I used to do it, but I've I went straight for the station this side. So uh, yeah, we'll see, we'll see anyway. So uh, I'll give a more review next week when I've had a chance to play on it a bit more. I, I there's no point doing two games going well. I'm never playing it again. <laughs> So, yeah, we'll see, we'll see. I am a COD fanboy, so I was a bit wounded, but the more I've played it, the more I've got into it, and the more I don't mind it. Different from COD, if you like your running around. I know if Kill Confirm was in again today, but the map's a bit too big for that type of game, to be honest. So, uh, yeah, yeah, so like I said, I haven't got to try everything. I haven't got to do everything, so I can't give a fucking review. But my own personal opinion, as someone has played COD... My last 10 years it's different but it's playable I like it <laughs> honestly it's mental I hate it but I like it so uh, it's like a bad relationship in it you get fucked over fucked over then you have the one night of pleasure then you get fucked over again so I'm not putting much hope into all the supply drops and that because obviously the more content the harder it is for it to process it but it's no real better for 5v5. Uh, but it's a beta. There are going to be many people playing it, as in local. So, uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see you next weekend. And anyway, so what we'll do, I'll give a proper full review next weekend when I get a chance to play it a bit more. And hopefully they've added all the new stuff. And I don't want to be critical. I'm not going to sit here shouting at it because it's not a bad game. It isn't. Played well. Got a couple of people on your team trying to help or even your team up. It can be quite fun. So, uh, yeah. So, I'm not sure what's happening in the week. <laughs> Story of my life. <laughs> so, I don't think there's any updates or anything major anyway. I think Clone Wars ain't until the fall. I think there might be some more skins than that for the uh, battle f Battlefront. Yeah. So, I don't know what's coming up in WW2. The last map pack shouldn't be too far off. So, we'll see. And I'll see there's a Battlefield 5 beta. If the worst thing about that, there's women in it, which I don't bother about, don't bother me. Bring it on! <laughs> and Red Dead. So I'm not too disappointed. I ain't gonna. I, I was going to cancel the pre-order, but I'm not going to keep it. it. has potential. So, uh, yeah, anyway, I hope you can hear me. I'll try on your new setup. I bought a new bit of kit, so I'm actually using a proper, proper mic now. And uh, a better camera, so hopefully I ain't glitching so much. I ain't going to move, because it always glitches on it. So, uh, yeah, yeah, so I'm going to do. Thanks for watching, and I'll do. I'll catch you all. Later.